It's rough out there. I might need backup if you can spare the people. I have strike teams specializing in assault and extraction. If you need serious firepower, my Apex teams have you covered. In fact, I could give you authority to dispatch them. It'll cut down their response time. Thank you. Our current ops are on the terminal. See if there's anything that could use a shot where it counts. Bye, Kandros. Duty calls. You and me both, Pathfinder. Apex hey, Ryder, I'd like a moment. Oh. Yes? Lieutenant Syax, right? That's me. I'm putting together Apex strike teams to protect the people and assets you're setting up out there. We don't have a good sense of what we're up against, and could benefit from your experience. There's no replacement for first-hand experience. I agree. But your insights on the assholes out there would really help. You'll see. Apex will make a difference. It's not right. It's not fair. What's wrong? Oh my, you're... So it's true. A Pathfinder has found this. There's hope at last. Maybe you could help. You're impartial. This whole thing has gotten so political. My husband, he's locked up and slated for exile for a crime he didn't commit. What exactly was he convicted of? They don't exile you for petty theft. Well, maybe this bunch would. They say it's murder. They're calling him the first murderer in Andromeda, but the dead man was his friend. He wouldn't have. There are witnesses and evidence, but it's all circumstantial. At worst, it was an accident. His name is Nilkin Rensis. He could give you the details if you were willing to speak with him. Please. I'd be happy to. Oh, thank you. I'm sure the Jailer will allow you a visit. Please, tell Milken I love him. A reminder to all personnel, overtime hours... Weekly injury back. report. One bar brawl, participants arrested. Weekly injury report. Minimum casualties. A good week. Superintendent Cash reminds everyone... It's you! You're the human Pathfinder! I'm Sid, Vetra's sister. Vetra's told me all about you. Well, not all about you, but the important bits. I should probably get back to work. It was real nice meeting you, though. What work do you do here? Oh, I just monitor comms from colonists. Progress updates, hazards encountered. Note it down, pass on a report to Sean at the end of the day. Important job. I know. It's nice to hand in a report and have someone say I helped. I'll let you get back to work. Davis Carr, Helios News Service. Maybe you've heard my voice over the vids. I'm trying to file a story right now, but hey. HNS, huh? Where are the rest of you? I had an editor, but it's crazy out here. Now, beyond a freelancer or two, I'm it. All that stands between freedom and tyranny, or something. I haven't had much sleep. Who pays for you to do this? Technically, HNS is an arm of the initiative, but we serve the public, not them. Sometimes the higher ups try and tell us what to broadcast, TAN especially, but we decide what to run and how to run it. It causes friction, but at least I can live with myself. Were you a journalist back in the Milky Way? I was. Sort of. Only had a couple internships under my belt. Good places, though. The New Star Chronicle even sent me to Mars for a week. The plan was just to work as a reporter out here. Then the uprising happened. We got a little too close. My editor was killed. 
Tan blamed our broadcasts for stirring unrest. It was bullshit. Now all I want to do is keep going. It must be difficult to set up a broadcast from scratch. No, it's easy. Beyond the lack of staff, resistant authorities, and constant technical glitches. Still, I'm getting there. May have an honest-to-goodness source in Nexus security, if she ever calls me back. Who's your source? No journalist worth their salt will ever give that up. I met another journalist, Carrie Tavessa. Yeah, we're running Carrie's series, Path of a Hero. Good stuff. I'm mostly on my own, so pretty much anyone who brings me news is welcome. Content is king, and her content is really touching a nerve. Talk to you later, Davis. Hey, Ryder, before you go, I hate to ask, but it seems like your job takes you all over, the places we can't broadcast yet. If I send receivers to your ship, would you mind placing them on some planets? It'll help get news out to even the most far-flung colonists. What do you need from me, exactly? I'm digging up good stories here, but not a lot of people beyond the Nexus can hear them. Our long-distance transmitter sends package data between ships, and even planet side, provided there's a receiver on the other end. I need someone to place receivers and boost our signal. We only have a few, so they need to go on planets with people. Okay, Davis. I'll help you get set up. Great. Just place a receiver near an outpost, and they'll get our reports. All personnel, be aware of any suspicious activity. Security is on heightened alert. Apex personnel, please. I'm sorry, Lana. They're just trying to boost our morale. Scan and trace the wiring to locate the panel that the saboteur used. Any idea as to who it might be? Yeah. All these panels were worked on by Zara. I just can't believe it. Security video logs confirm that Zara Kellis worked on these panels, as well as the one Raj Patil encountered. Well, shit. Any idea where she is now? Kellis is currently working on a panel on the Hyperion main deck. I gave Prodromos the best start a Pathfinder could, but we can't predict everything. We just do our best. You, 
Pathfinder, I have a word or two for you. Is there a problem? Your father is my problem. He's everyone's problem. We're all paying for Alec Ryder's ego. He preyed on Jean Garson's trusting nature and bulldozed us to this godforsaken place. Now she's dead, and we'll all soon follow. Hey, my dad died for this dream. He was trying to fix things for all of us. Some dream. He fixed us all right. Go to hell, Pathfinder. <laughs>